The goal of the Guam Regional Transit Authority is to live within its means while serving the public. Interim Executive Manager Felix Dunka says that's what they will try to do with their $3.1 million budget for fiscal year 2012, which was slightly cut from their original $3.3 million request. Dunka says while they will discuss their new budget, their board will also talk about wanting to hire a permanent executive manager for the past two years and how they were so close to hiring someone before the end of September. In long story short, we, uh, we weren't able to recruit that person before the end of the fiscal year. Oh, so we were hoping that we could do that in the beginning of this fiscal year. Right. And uh, so we've been monitoring and the position was funded under the FY12 budget. But then, in further review of the budget document, there's a clause there that freezes all hiring. Dunka says the freeze is most likely due to the uh, government of Guam's shortfall. And while there is a delay for now, they continue to advise the people at the front office to give them the green light in hiring someone. But on the plus side, Dunka adds the procurement of up to 12 brand new state-of-the-art buses is moving forward. He notes it will take about a year and a half to do with their partner, Parsons Brinkerhoff. If we purchase those 12 buses, we could realistically assign them to our service provider and replace the entire fleet with brand new buses. Because right now we operate a 10, 10 bus fleet. Everything so boils down would, uh, to funding, but Dunka that. notes we could see new buses by 2013 around the island. Another project GRTA is working on is when fees will be raised. He says fees haven't been raised in several years, stating it's at 35 cents a ride for ADA riders and a dollar a ride for regular riders. That's one of the things that I will be pursuing in the next few weeks is to draft up a proposed fee schedule and present it to the board. And of course, you know, uh, any fee schedule has to go to a public hearing. Sure. You know, um, um, I think everybody realizes that even the writers, uh, when they were here several months ago in a meeting, they, they you know, they recognize that, um, that there's, there's going to be an increase in the fees and, yeah. and they don't have any problems with that.